today on making my house a home. I'm getting back to my roots with this. I'm going out front. Hobster's gonna put the blade in. And I'm gonna go dig me some roots. Stick with me while I get back to my roots. Ha ha, pun intended. I don't expect you to do this. Why? Because it's too much work. Well, it's too much for me to do too. Well, <laughs> but I was just gonna start cutting stuff off a little at a time. That's why I bought and this. And we can cut stuff off. How far down do you wanna go? Well, I got uh, sunflowers to put in here. Okay. Well. And if I don't get the ones on the end, I don't care. The one in the middle is the problem. I guess it used to be a tree. My grass guy says it's a sumac tree. Yep, it will be. They grow where you don't want them to. Well, I don't want it to, that's for sure. See, when I saw that one there, I thought, well, I'll cut through that with this. Great. And you can. We will get that one easy. It's the one that went straight down the bottom. There's always a root that goes straight down to the bottom. Really? Oh, yeah. Well, the, the size of this tree there would be how big the roots are. Well, he okay. says it's a different tree that's from what, that right, one. Right, but trees are trees. The, that's what supports them. They're, and they have to... What's underground is just as big as what's on top. If it's a healthy tree. Oh. Otherwise, it's not healthy. And at some point, we'll die. Okay, well, we'll get this one off the, off the lift. That one over there is not as easy. As you can cut this one without throwing your blade up too much. Cut most of the dirt away from it. You want to cut right there? Okay. Can you do that or you want me to do it? What's I can try. Here? Videoing it? Yeah. Well, you want me to do it and you video? If you want. Yep. Yeah, you did buy a new one. Oh, wait. You got an awful big blade. Here. here. It fell out. <laughs> yep, it will. Yeah, Jeff tells me I'm crazy, but I guess I am. <laughs> Sorry, right. you fit in in this world. <laughs> True. <laughs> Maybe back during the settlers, they might have raised questions with you. In this world, you fit in. All right, let's try this. So this is my lovely Are neighbor, you sure Ken. You're plugged in on the other end. Yeah. Because we don't have anything. Well, let me check. Looks like I won't be getting my root out. And they still want to grow on you. Hmm? I said it may still want to grow on you. That's the problem. The one that went down to the bottom. I 
I have a friend that was going to bring over one of those and do that, and they never showed. I appreciate you doing this. Uh, well, I can't say that we've done it yet either. Well, you're doing more than I could have. Yeah. All right. About, don't worry about the dirt. Yeah, it'll have to go back up somehow. I'll work on it. You have to buy some fabric to hold it. I have some. So Tuesday, I'm having surgery again. Oh. Wednesday. Wednesday. They're going to work on my belly. Bless your heart. Oh, number 29. That's... It should be free after the first three. You would think so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you're that good a customer, you need to be rewarded. <laughs> I mean, Frequent flyer out, miles. So. Something, yeah. Everybody else does it. They give you a card for three cents off a gallon, or no, they just keep sending taking you out a bill. parts. Oh, well, there's another little one. Yeah. Oh, that one came apart easy. Oh, yeah. Lost that one out. I guess this is some kind of sumac tree, yeah. according to the Leaves grass a guy. Pelicho. Lay it down, you'll have to hold it. I don't want to break it. Okay. Am I too close over here? No, you'll be alright. your thing broken no it just uh, it needs to be soaked in water and put another uh, wedge in it one of those little things that uh -huh. it, it isn't used and therefore it's not maintained but yeah the head's loose it can't come off the top's bigger than the You're doing what nobody wanted to do. <clears throat> I can see why nobody wanted to do it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Sorry. You didn't get me. And I won't be complaining about a thing. <laughs> Not a thing. Okay, you may want to... I wonder why they put something like that in here. Oh, because it'll grow anywhere. <laughs> yeah, but it's a tree. Well, you can keep it small, too. Stay after it and trim. I don't know that they did that. No. It grew on its own, I think you'll find. They put the shrubs in. 
That yeah. was intentional. Yeah. But. If at any point you want to give up, I would understand. No. This thing amazed me when I found this little snake-like deal. That's the root. Yeah, yeah, I was getting in the dirt and I was like, what the heck? I thought I found a snake. Was that the handle? Yes. <laughs> oh my. It's an old handle. Dirty bugger you. You're gone. Yep. All right. You're awesome, Ken. Wow. I wish I would have been smarter and used my head more than my... It would have hurt your head. No, in <laughs> life. Yeah. <laughs> I hear you. But I was never opposed to getting my hands dirty. Awesome. Wow, this is pretty heavy, too. I can put my sunflowers in now. I got seven of them to go in. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, and I don't have that. I sure don't have that. Here. 
Yeah, that's just one of the roots. There's a whole bunch underneath it, too. That's unreal. I never thought they'd be that big. Oh, my. Yeah, that's how they grow. fit in the bag. It's their only criteria. Okay. Everything has to fit in the bag. Awesome. So that's the end of a uneventful video for me, but eventful for my next door neighbor who saw me going out there with my reciprocating saw and I borrowed an extension cord because ours wouldn't reach all the way out front. And when he saw what I was doing, he went, nope, you're not doing that. So God bless Ken, my next door neighbor. He lives in this house and he and his wife are just wonderful, wonderful people. They're really, really good to us. So, uh, yeah, got that done and got the center, as you saw, most of it out of the ground. There's still a bunch way underground, but at least now I can plant these out front for good. And then they'll be happy and I'll be happy. That's the way it's got to have to be. So with that, I'll plant them now and I'll dig you later. Take care.